सडन इन्फेंट डेथ एस आई डी ऑल्सो नोन एज सडन इन्फेंट डेथ सिंड्रोम एस आई डी इज अ ट्रेजिक एंड अनएक्सप्लेन फिनोमिना वेयर एन अदरवाइज हेल्दी बेबी टिपिकली अंडर द एज ऑफ वन डाई सडनली एंड अनएक्सपेक्टेडली ड्यूरिंग स्लीप रिसर्च इज ऑन गोइंग टू अंडरस्टैंड इट्स कॉजेज एंड वेरियस सेफ प्रैक्टिस आर रिकमेंडेड to reduce the risk today's topic is at most important to all parents and caregivers preventing sudden infant death syndrome or sids it is a heart breaking reality but there are proactive steps you can take to reduce the risk stick around as we share 13 crucial tips to ensure your baby's safety <laughs> tip number 1 create a safe sleep environment the first tip is all about the sleep environment always place your baby on their back to sleep in a crib with a firm mattress and no loose bedding a snug fitting crib sheet is key and avoid soft toys and bumper pads that could pose a suffocation risk tip number 2 room sharing without bed sharing consider room sharing without bed sharing having your baby's crib in your room for the first 6 months can reduce the risk of sids however avoid bed sharing as it increase the risk of accidental suffocation or strangulation tip number 3 use a pacifier did you know that using a pacifier during nap and bedtime can reduce the risk of sids it's true the american academy of pediatrics suggests offering a pacifier after breastfeeding is established breastfeeding breastfeeding has numerous benefits and it's associated with a lower risk of sids if possible try to breastfeed your baby it is not only a bonding experience but also contributes to their overall health and well-being tip number 5 avoid overheating maintain a comfortable room temperature for your baby overheating has been linked to increased risk of sids dress your baby in lightweight clothing and use a sleep sack instead of blankets to keep them cozy without the risk of overheating tip number 6 regular well baby checkup regular doctors follow ups checkups are essential to stay on top of your baby's vaccinations and make sure to attend all scheduled appointments keeping your baby healthy is a key factor in reducing the risk of sids tip number 7 avoid smoking and passive smoking but here is a crucial tip for parents and caregivers quit smoking smoking during pregnancy and exposing your baby to second hand smoke increase the risk of sids create a smoke free environment for your little one tip number 8 tummy time Encourage tummy time when your baby is awake and supervised. This not only helps prevent flat spots on their head but also contributes to their overall development. However, always place your baby on their back to sleep. Tip number 9, use a firm sleep surface. Ensure your baby sleeps on a firm surface. Soft surface like sofa, armchair, and water beds are not safe for sleep invest in a good quality crib mattresses that meets safety standards tip number 10 educate caregivers whether it is grandparents babysitter providers or daycare providers make sure everyone caring for your baby is aware of safe sleep practices share these tips and guideline to ensure a consistent approach to your baby's safety tip number 11 create a smoke free pregnancy start prioritizing your baby's health before they even arrive if you are pregnant make sure it is a priority to create a smoke free environment this can significantly reduce the risk of sids once your baby is born tip number 12 avoid over bundling while keeping your baby warm is important avoid over bundling too many layers or heavy blankets can lead to overheating opt for lightweight breathable layers to keep your baby comfortable tip number 13 trust your instinct 
trust your instincts if something doesn't feel right or your baby seems unwell don't hesitate to seek medical attention your intuition as a parent is a powerful tool in keeping your baby safe remember knowledge is power and by implementing these practices you are taking proactive steps to ensure a safe and healthy environment for your precious little one if you found this video helpful don't forget to give a thumbs up subscribe to our channel and share it with other parents until next time take care and keep those little ones safe see you soon